Welcome to my demonstration on using the melting pot with um, the Spellbinder dies. I've used ultra thick embossing powder and I've used the um, Wow embossing powder with it, copper. Um, these um, Shapeability Delight Spellbinder dies come in um, different uh, designs and today I just want to show you how to use the Ooty with the dies. They won't hurt them in any way and um, all you have to do is arrange the die exactly how you want it and then gently pull around the heart you've got the ridge of the heart and just pull around it filling it all in leave it to to cool down to dry to set that's the word I'm looking for to set these dies are just fabulous with the Ooty. Um, once the, they are it's set, you can just tease the die away. I'm not sure whether that's dry yet. I'm not sure whether that's set. Let me have a go. No, it's still hot. You can remove the outer heart. Set. Turn it over and then just gently tease this heart off and you've got a lovely embellishment for a card. If those um, of you like your altered art, I've just got started doing altered art, this will be lovely on uh, addition to the work um, that you've been using. As you can see, the heart has got a lot of intricate detail and to make this detail pop, I'm using Creative Expressions Metallic Gilding Wax and for this one I'm using the Enchanted Gold and all you do is lightly rub over, rub over your, your Ooty. still a bit hot but um, if you can stand the heat kind of glides on easier. It's just that little bit warmer. And there you have it. A heart, another way of using your spellbinder dies, not only for cards, but with uh, your melting pot and your Ooty. Thank you for stopping by today. I hope you've enjoyed. Bye bye.